So today I'm just going to show off the, uh, this is a high standard Supermatic tournament. Now I've got a Vortex Optic on there on a Picatinny rail and this custom, it's like an aluminum barrel. I forget who makes it. And this is a Mitchell Arms. It is a Trophy 2. It's kind of like a Supermatic. You can actually put the Supermatic slide on the Mitchell Arms, but you can't put this slide on the Supermatic. Um, the barrels are interchangeable. They work on either or and um, they both have a really light crisp trigger pull on them they're nice nice pistols i'm gonna go ahead and load up a magazine and then i'm gonna show you shooting both of them and then changing the barrels out and uh, show you how that works as well as like adult legos there's the mitchell arms Load up another mag here. I'll shoot the high standard. This one doesn't actually have an optic on it right now, but I can still look down it and be fairly accurate. Uh, with an optic though, both of these things are really, really accurate. All right, let's try changing the barrel out here. Pull that barrel off. Now this barrel here will fit on here, but because of the sights on the back and I don't want to take it off, the Picatinny rail runs back too far, so I'm not going to be putting this onto here, but I will be putting the uh, the other barrel onto the Mitchell Arms. Just kind of show you here that it does work. Only one magazine. Mitchell Arms, when I bought it, did not come with a magazine. Only the high standard did. I just haven't went out and purchased another one yet because they're kind of spendy for an original. You can get the aftermarket ones, I heard, for about half the price, but I don't know how well they work or if you'd have to tune the feed lips or I've heard different stories. Let's try this guy out. Let's see. Perfectly fine. So there you have it. There's a Mitchell Arms Trophy 2 and the high standard Supermatic. They both have target style grips on them. The thumb rest. This one's got gold plating on the trigger and the magazine release. And this one has kind of, uh, the high standard has a, uh, looks like a hardened steel almost. So, or what do they call that? Um, case hardened steel. So both, both great pistols though. And that, uh, that concludes this video. You guys take it easy.